Hello everybody, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for May 11th, 2020. Today we have perception. Yes, so our perceptions are changing. We are, something's getting revealed. Like we are completely changing how we look at things. We're, we've been saying changing our priorities. We are definitely, we have our eyes open. We have our eyes open. Now there will be a part of the population, we've been saying this, that will remain asleep. We have to give them room to do whatever they're doing, okay? That doesn't mean if they're harming other people, we don't just allow that. But I'm saying if people want to, because we have the people who they've experienced some pain, some trauma, so they have shut down their emotions because maybe they feel like their emotions have betrayed them. They end up going out and, and not taking their feelings into consideration. Therefore, they don't have maybe, for some people don't have a moral compass. They just don't, okay? Um, and maybe they're, actually out harming people. And then you have this next layer that's right, just kind of orbiting those kinds of people, and those are the enablers. Okay, now those people might be brainwashed by people who have shut down their feelings, quite possibly. Um, but these are also people who are coming from, maybe in, in some cases, a, an ego standpoint, where they're like, I wanna look good to others by looking like I'm super loving and compassionate, and I wanna be balanced, and so I'm gonna always look at the opposite side of everything because that makes me a good person. And what they're not realizing is that they are playing right into what people with no empathy want you to play into. And you're supporting them, you're feeding them. So we're gonna start seeing this. And a lot of people in that band that kind of goes around people with no empathy, if, if, they get to wake up here if they're not too deep in the sleep when they wake up there's probably gonna be a lot of apologies coming I wouldn't bank on it but like you know, I mean some of you might experience someone coming and saying oh my gosh I'm sorry I doubted you when you tried to open up and tell me that you were being abused I'm so sorry I doubted you or I'm so sorry that I judged you for having that response I didn't know this person was doing this to you I know you told me they were you know, but that's what we're talking about here. The perception, we're really going to be opening our eyes. We're going to be seeing things for what they are. I don't know. I think there's going to be a definite uh, change in approach here across the board. They're saying that the eye, your eyes are open and they will remain open now. For most people, they will now remain open. And so more and more stuff is going to start coming up to the surface. I heard somebody say one time, oh, we just need to get to a place where we can be happy. There's just too much going on. We just need to get to a place where we can be happy. The idea is to not wait for your happiness. The happiness is happening right now. You have to find something to be grateful for. Find the happiness now. Because if you're waiting for everything to quote unquote settle down before you can feel at ease, things aren't gonna be settled down probably for the rest of our lives. We are on fast forward evolution. Why? Because we've been dragging our feet too long. <laughs> right? We're playing catch up right now. And that's probably gonna be going on for the next few years. So get ready for that. Find the peace, find the love, find the compassion right now. So we're gonna leave it there, guys. I'm sending you so much love and take care. Bye-bye.